Hello YouTube. Today I'll be showing you guys what's inside this wood cabinet. Like the previous video where I scrapped one of the speakers. This is from a different machine. So yeah, the majority of the weight comes from the wood cabinet. Right now I'm just removing all of the um, power wires. I'll go to the speakers I believe. Or the actual just uh, power stuff. So, yeah. This is probably not going to have much either. But, let's find out. So, once again, just remove the triple set of screws. There's four in each set. Oops. There's one. There should be a little bit more um, value in this. Actually, there's only That's nice. So it looks like we just undo some cabling. And there we go. So now we've got a whole bunch of wire here. This is going to be number two. All right. Small amount of wire. Not much. Once again. Oops. We just lost a couple. No problem. I can just open up this cabinet and get out the rest of them. So now going to undo a whole bunch of screws on this part, and I'll be right back. Alright. Opening it up. That's quite interesting. It's very clean. Good job, Panasonic. Look at that. A whole bunch of free wire. It's like opening up a treasure chest, which in fact gives me an idea. I might actually be able to use this um, to hold secret items. I don't know. I probably won't though. Anyway, it's big and heavy and too much trash. So I'm just removing eight screws, four on each speaker. I believe these are the um guessing the main subwoofers. I'm not too sure. Forgive me if I'm wrong on that. Here we go. Look at that. Heavy magnet. Like at a microwave. Anyway, these are some heavy duty magnets. So if your scrapyard accepts magnets, it's a good idea to pull these off because these are heavy. So yeah, inside each of these speakers, there's a little magical surprise. As you can tell, there's two little power wires. Both of these are number two copper. 
Yeah, because they have staining over them. They're not insulated. They're actually copper with a little bit of like thread inside. Almost reminds me of solder wick. So if you know what solder wick is, which is what you use in these soldering, you should know exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, there we go. Another piece. But we're not done yet. Like Billy May says. Inside. Trash. Inside here. Look at that. Nice band of copper. So in each of these, there's some copper. So you want to pull it off. It's real easy. You just snip at that and then... It all comes right off. You could even leave it on there for number two, but if you want, spend a little extra time, pour it off. I'm not going to do it on the camera because that would take too long, and make a little extra money. Now, repeat on the other side. Screwdrivers like to fly out of my hands. The reason why I never ever get drills is, um, I probably would, but at the same time, there's another motor. Um, you can keep your dexterity strong by doing it yourself, and when you do it yourself, you may not make as much money. But it does keep your dexterity very precise. So, yeah. And the rest of this is wood cabinet. So, that's about it. A little bit, much, much better compared to the regular um, tiny speakers. But still, not too much. So yeah, hope you found that video interesting and useful. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more content in the future from the e Man, and I'll see you guys later.